Welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into the application of different band combinations of Landsat 9. Landsat 9 satellite imagery offers a wealth of information about the Earth's surface by capturing data across multiple spectral bands. In ArcGIS Pro, you can enhance and manipulate these bands to highlight specific features, making it easier to analyze landscapes, vegetation, urban areas, and more. The following are some of the most commonly used band combinations of Landsat 9 and their applications. 1. Natural color bands. 4. 3. 2. Band combination. Red or band 4. Green or band 3. Blue or band 2. In the natural color combination, vegetation appears in shades of green. Water bodies are depicted in blue. Urban areas are shown in gray or white and bare soil is typically brown or light tan. This band combination is ideal for visual interpretation of landscapes, human-made structures, and large-scale land cover, as it closely resembles what the human eye would see. It's commonly used for general-purpose mapping and interpretation. Second false color bands 5, 4, 3. Band combination, near-infrared. Band 5, red band 4, green band 3. Application widely used in vegetation analysis. With the false color combination, healthy vegetation appears bright red, while water is represented as dark blue or black. Urban areas typically show up in cyan or light blue, and bare soil appears in shades of brown or tan. This band combination is primarily used for vegetation health analysis, allowing users to easily distinguish between healthy and stressed vegetation, making it useful for monitoring agriculture and forestry. 3. Color Infrared, Bands 5, 6, 4. Band Combination, Near Infrared, Band 5. Short Wave Infrared 1, Band 6. Red, Band 4. Application. This combination is also used for vegetation analysis, but with an emphasis on plant health and water content. In color infrared imagery, vegetation takes on a bright red to pink hue, depending on its health, while water is displayed as dark blue or black. Urban areas are shown in blue or light blue, and bare soil appears in shades of brown or yellowish colors. This combination is particularly effective for monitoring vegetation health, assessing moisture levels, and managing crops, as well as tracking changes in land cover. 4. Agriculture Identification Band 6, 5, 2 Band Combination Shortwave Infrared 1 Band 6 Near Infrared Band 5 Blue, band two. Application. Ideal for analyzing agricultural crops and moisture levels. This band combination emphasizes agricultural features, with vegetation appearing red or pink, depending on moisture content and health. Water bodies are dark blue or black, while bare soil is displayed in light brown or tan. Urban areas show up as light gray or white. It's particularly useful in agriculture for analyzing crop conditions, soil moisture, and detecting drought-prone areas. 5. Urban Areas, Band 7, 6, 4. Band Combination, Shortwave Infrared 2, Band 7. Shortwave Infrared 1, Band 6, Red Band 4. Application, commonly used for urban area mapping and monitoring. In this combination, urban areas stand out in cyan or light blue allowing for easy identification of man-made structures. Vegetation shows up in dark green or red, water is represented as dark blue or black, and bare soil appears in light brown to pinkish colors. It's widely used for urban planning and monitoring infrastructure development, making it easier to differentiate between natural and built environments. 6. Moisture Index, Bands 6, 5, 3, Band Combination, Shortwave Infrared 1, Band 6. Near Infrared, Band 5. Green, Band 3. Application, used for monitoring moisture content in soils and vegetation. This combination highlights water content in vegetation and soil. Vegetation appears red, while water shows up in dark blue or black. Bare soil is depicted in brown or tan, and urban areas are rendered in blue or cyan. It's particularly useful for analyzing soil moisture monitoring drought conditions, and managing water resources. 7. Geology, Bands, 762. Band combination, 
shortwave infrared, 2, band 7, shortwave infrared 1, band 6, blue, band 2. Application employed in geological mapping and mineral exploration. In geological mapping, different rock formations and minerals are represented in shades of pink, purple, and yellow. Water bodies appear dark blue or black, while bare soil is shown in varying shades of brown, yellow, and orange. Vegetation is depicted in dark green. This combination is helpful for identifying rock and soil types, making it valuable in geological studies and mineral exploration. Eight, atmospheric penetration, band seven, five, three. This band combination is designed to penetrate atmospheric particles such as haze or smoke. Vegetation appears red, water is dark blue or black, urban areas show up in cyan or light blue, and bare soil is depicted in brown or light tan.